Hi guys, this is Dhruv Bhutani from Phone Arena and I'm going to give you a walkthrough of the Micromax A90. Uh, now Micromax has generally been known for pretty low-end devices and uh, the A90 kind of sets it apart. Let's just uh, take a look at the phone from the outside at first. Um, a massively glossy display. It's uh, just a display, there are no capacitive buttons as such. Uh, take a look at the side and we have our power key. There's no camera key on this. Uh, on the other side, we've got the volume rockers. Up top, there is a micro USB port. And uh, the cool thing about this is that it has a slider shutter, which basically just covers it and uh, protects it from dust. So there's that. And a 3.5 mm jack on the side. So uh, let's go to the back. And now this is where things get interesting. Uh, if you've been following the mobile scene closely over the past year or so, you'll instantly recognize this. It looks exactly like a Galaxy S2. It's got the 8 megapixel camera with a single LED flash over here and a very simple uh, Micromax logo. If you hide this, you'd probably mistake this for a Samsung phone. Uh, let's switch it on. So it's running on a MediaTek MT675 processor uh, and is coupled with a PowerVR SGX531 GPU. The GPU is pretty decent um, and um, after using it I'd say the processor is not too bad either. Uh, it's been optimized for the dual SIM, a dual active SIM which is available on this phone. Uh, and it's pretty spe speedy all around. So. As you can see, just going to run through stuff over here. The entire UI is pretty smooth. Uh, you'd struggle to find any slowdowns. Uh, let's take a look at multitasking. So as you can see, I've got a lot of apps running over here. And it's smooth all around. Um, Customizations are pretty minimum, minimal over here, uh, basically just around the icons, for example as you can see here the contacts and uh, phone icons have been customized and so have been some other ones. There are a few pre-bundled apps as well, but overall uh, Micromax has done well by not uh, playing around with the core ICS at much. So let's take a look at Tempo Run on the Micromax A90. Um, so gameplay seems to be smooth for the most part. No slowdowns over there. The hardware is very solid. I really like the screen on this. It's a Super AMOLED display 4.3 inches with uh, WVGA resolution. Uh, nice and bright. Screen touch, the touch response is excellent. And uh, obviously, the, uh, you've got the on-screen buttons over here going by the ICS guidelines. And uh, these move out of view when you've got a full screen video running. So there's a, that's always great. It's a good pocketable size, um, battery life is rather excellent. So that's about it. If you've got any specific questions, do let us know and uh, we'll be sure to answer that.